on VDSA 30 back with another deck review, basically two decks. This is the Spar deck from Li Tin, who is a magician, I guess, in China. And this is a collector's edition. This is the kind of standard collector's edition with red and blue decks. There's also a more limited one with black and white decks, which I have not seen on Penguin Magic or anywhere else. I'm guessing those are more of an Asian release. Doesn't really matter. Uh, of course, um, I'll show you the box. The front of the box is Spar in EV ink. Unfortunately, it got some damage in shipping there and there, but it is what it is. It's just a simple box. There's nothing else on it except for more damage. <laughs> Inside, you get the T decks, and you got this card. With a little bit of a warning on it. And inside there is some more information. Voila, and we'll tell you the back because it's a marking system. The blue deck is a special deck. It is marked and is a stripper deck. The red deck is just standard. Now, originally there was a Lee 10 deck that came out several years back, in maybe 2010, 2012. I don't really remember. In fact, I think it was at least 10 years ago, apparently. And um, actually, maybe it says here. The S deck and the M deck, he refers to them as. Um, and apparently he went back and forth a lot with the designers I got back in the day. It even annoyed the USB-C, all his specifications and whatnot, but eventually he got it produced. The original was 1000 X was 10 years ago, and now it's been 10 years, and he's decided he run out, so he's going to produce some more decks and that's what he did the original is black i do have it you can see with you on my channel um if you don't know who Cy si scott is Cy si scott is the designer of the smoking bears which is why this perhaps looks a little familiar because it does kind of look like smoking bears the front says Li Chen and spar this is standard top cases Li Chen, illustrated by Cy si scott in case there's any doubt the united states point guard company Li Chen studio production We'll add copy in the bottom, and in the back is the pack design. And those seals, uh, these ones, I can't recall if there was a number on how many were printed. Inside, you get a zero of spades reveal. There's your pack design. And you get a double backer. The joker is this lizard guy. And then this one is more of a small joke. It's the same thing, except it says Lee Chen Studio Production. The uh, Ace of Spades says Spar, has a cuffs and pip. And then the rest of the cards are completely standard USB-C. Now, they did not specify stock or finish it it feels like a fairly standard stock always the generic isn't finish feels I don't know fairly standard I don't know if there was any special specifications they didn't specify but it handles very nicely the blue one like I said is a mark deck and a stripper deck I won't go over the marking system but the cards you get are all the same except that it's blue those are not marked for the record with your jokers, and there's the rest of the cards completely the same. And of course, like I said, it's a stripper deck. Maybe if I scroll through the cards, you'll notice some differences and perhaps figure out the marking system yourself. Overall, pretty nice decks. Nice quality. I do like that it's marked in stripper. The marking system's not terrible maybe i can identify a card here if i'm lucky uh six of hearts i want to say six or something six of clubs i was gonna say clubs too damn i i didn't memorize the suit markings all that much but anyways <laughs> that's a pretty good marking system so that is that i will give these and hey, I like them. The box could have been nicer, but the, the deck's are nice enough. And that is that.
comment, like, subscribe, let me know what you think. These are available from various magic retailers like Penguin Magic. And yeah, we'll see you next time with more. Thanks for watching.